Are you kidding me? Oh, no, 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 no. Oh, crap, 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 crap. Let me get him. Come on. Yeah. We get this dude. Am I gonna be okay? I'm probably not gonna be able to fight this. Okay, we gotta we gotta run. Okay, so I wanted to start off today's video by going out and looking for the Dodic that we saw a couple episodes ago. We saw him basically in this area, um, but it was really, really hurt. By the way, that one down there, that's not it. That's like a level 18. Jim is just dying constantly. The second I logged on, he died, and his raptor died, I think, as well. So he's having a really hard time. I did offer my help, but uh, I don't know if he's being seeing those messages. It's okay, though. Anyway, so yeah, we're, we're looking for the Dodic. I don't see it at all. It, it could have easily been killed. It was already pretty hurt. Um, or it could have just despawned or wandered off really, really far. I don't really want to run around a huge amount looking for it. But I'll just take a quick look, look up on this hill here. And if I can't see it, then I can't see it. And it's all good. Um, yeah, I don't know if we're going to be able to spot this dude. I will parachute down. Let's see. Um, maybe you guys can see it. I, I can't. I can't see him. So, yeah. Speaking of things that I can't see, by the way, yeah, we're gonna go over and try and get that drop that I missed in the last episode. Um, here's the thing. A lot of people were saying that they could hear it. Um, I actually have the sound in my ears coming through a lot uh, quieter than you guys will hear in the video. I usually boost that in, um, in post-production. So yeah, like, <laughs> I didn't hear it and I didn't see it. It was kind of hard to see, to be honest. But um, yeah, a couple people probably spotted it regardless. But uh, yeah, so we're going to try and grab that here today. It was like all the way over there by that like river and there was like a little archway. Honestly, like the weirdest spot to find some treasure, but it's okay. All right, let me get down here. So what I want to do is I want to actually work on some little like basic base defenses. Um, I've been kind of tempted to add another mod to the server. Castles, uh, keeps and forts. Is that how you say it, right? I believe that's what it's called. It's the castles mod. We all know what it is, basically. It's a really, really cool mod, which, by the way, if that gets ported to uh, to console here pretty soon with ASA, then, oh, you boys are going to have some really fun, like, times with that thing, because, oh, my God, that mod is fantastic. It's really, really cool. So I might actually add that. It would kind of fit the aesthetic of this map and everything, but, um, yeah, that's kind of something that I've been thinking of. So real quick, we're going to work on just some spike fences. Honestly, that's kind of what I want for the moment. In fact, let me actually craft a uh, S plus crafting station. Whereabouts is that? All the way up here. There we go. Boom. We got one of those coming. So yeah, I'm going to craft a bunch of spike fences in here. It will make it a lot quicker. Uh, let's pop that down right there. I have no idea where Jim's respawning, by the way. Um, I got to check out his video after and see what's what's been happening hopefully this one's not uh, a little bit of spoilers for him but um it's okay you guys have something something good in store very clearly oh my god all right so 20 for the moment could be good i might need a couple more but i do have a decent amount of wood i just went out collecting some so yeah let me also actually chuck away some of this other stuff oh you can also see i actually i, I rebuilt everything uh, after the last episode's disaster which by the way left me with this really cool like straw hat is that a regular arc skin? Because I don't recognize it. If it is, then cool. But if it isn't, then also really, really cool. I got it from the um, the Paleo Raptor. So, yeah. Anyway, so I... <laughs> God, dude. I uh, I did go ahead and rebuild everything. And then I popped a... Uh, uh, what do you call it? A fence foundation right here. And then we have like a double door and then just two stone walls there. Just to keep it completely safe inside of there. Because obviously, you know... Yeah, it's pretty dumb that that happened and I could have potentially added some defenses to here. But for the most part, so far, everything that's happened in this series has been stuff that you guys have been seeing. So there's not a whole lot else that's been going on behind the scenes. Like sometimes I'll do things between videos, but so far with this one, I haven't really been doing that. I don't know where I want to start these fences. I might actually just, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to just probably pop some down to like little spots where they might be able to get through. Um, and then just in general, we'll... Um, trying to like section off an area hello mr bronto pooping in my my area in my little field all right let's see so maybe we can go from like just slightly past the uh, the little stables right here let's see let's pop some of these guys down i'm gonna need to leave a little bit of a gap i guess what i can do is i can actually just place them all down and then i can just remove one and then we'll have our gap from that uh let's go out like that cool all right let's see so i'd probably want the gate maybe like right around oh what's that get my stuff again oh man <laughs> jim oh i love him so much <laughs> he has such trouble sometimes but then again i've been also having some trouble as well so yeah i can't really uh can't really blame him um let's see let's get the rest of these down probably be more helpful if i actually went onto the outside all right i offered my help you guys can't say i'm not i don't do good things for people <laughs> all right let's see uh i gotta actually take that away from the snap uh how do i 
Uh, okay, I need to do it like this. Uh, how do I stop it from snapping? Is this it? Oh, there we go. Yeah, you just got to hit G a couple times. Boom. So yeah, the S plus ones do snap, which is kind of nice, but sometimes it's kind of annoying. Uh, there we go. That's that's good enough. It looks pretty vicious around here with all these spikes and everything, but you know, all in all, like it's kind of needed. Yeah, I can't fit through there. That's good. It's kind of needed because, you know, like freaking Alpha Raptor spawning in my area. I also need to make this place spawn proof as well. Uh, that's another thing to do, but you know, that's all for another time. Um, so that's good enough. They're not going to be able to easily run in here. Like, they could easily still get in here, obviously, but I'm okay with that. If they get in, it's fine. They could also just spawn in here, too. So we, we probably need to pop down some foundations. The only thing I'm worried about is I don't want to lose the crops. That's one thing. So, yeah, hopefully that doesn't happen. Um, we're past half eight. That means that there's no moon tonight. It hasn't popped out just yet, so we're all good. Um, let's see. So that was the first thing that I wanted to do. Next up, I want to actually go over and grab that drop. I need to at this point, you know? And also, I've actually been trying to, like, ma mark them on my map right here. So we have the one back here. I've already checked it. I'm going to check it again before we go. Okay, no loot drop back there, and I've grabbed my bullets, so I'm all good to go here. We're just going to work our way up the cliff here and then probably try to parachute a little bit. Um, I could probably try to run across the terrain, but it is kind of dark right now. And I don't really know what kind of spawns have been out there here today. So, you know, maybe it's for the best, you know, it, it, in terms of keeping my horse and my Pachyranosaurus alive. It, this would definitely be the best idea. So, yeah, we're going to do it. Oh, my God, Jim. <laughs> I have offered you my help. Do you need it? <laughs> dude you can't do much more when you've already offered the help and they don't see yes so yeah <laughs> if i come across him i'll help him but i don't know where he is oh what the hell oh is that a paleo uh carno is it let's see <gasps> oh it is it's a 156 as well dude that's terrifying oh is he eating an office no i wanted that office well i mean i didn't know it was there but like now that it's there and i know it's there i want it um <laughs> <laughs> all right well it's roughly in this direction let's do it um we're super far out obviously but you know we're gonna parachute most of the way there and then run a little bit more after that i think i actually see the area i think that that spot right there is exactly where this drop is so hopefully it's gonna still be there um i don't know if they despawn or whatever i mean jim could have come across it as well so who knows but uh yeah we're gonna we're gonna get all the way over there and uh hopefully grab that one thing I'm kind of curious about, if you guys know, um, where the hell do you find gems here on this map? Because I really want, like, glow sticks. I want, like, climbing picks. I want a glide suit. I want all that stuff. So I, I need to find the gems. I have no idea where to find them so far. I haven't actually come across any at all. So, yeah, if anybody knows, let me know. Just gliding my way through the air. We're almost there. Um, I could probably start landing here. In fact... Let me go ahead and get my horse ready. Um, I should actually pull a name from the last episode for that guy as well. I'm so bad at it. Like, I, I obviously see the names and stuff. And, like, I I pick out nice ones. But then I forget what they are. And then I'm like, oh, yeah, I need to go get that. You know, when I hop onto the server, it's not the first thing I think of. But it should probably be moving on, uh, moving forward from here. Hello. Ah, damn it. <laughs> okay. Yeah, we lost that 174. I, I'm looking for another one if we can manage to find one. Let's see. Here we go. We get the horse. And, oh, crap. I still forgot to make a saddle for you. Or did I make one and just forget to... No, I don't think I made it at all. I gotta do that as soon as I get back. So, let's see. Let me get all the way over here. Oh, have I been to this house? There's a citronol here. Let's see. What do we got inside here? Is this something? What the hell is this? What is all this? Is this breakable? No. <laughs> I'm like, I come into this house and I just want to break things. Uh, let's see. Grab all this cementing paste sweet uh can't do anything with this i guess that's pretty cool all right uh can't do anything with that this is breakable lots of barrels in here which is great in fact would it be better to use my hatchet on them i don't even know um i feel like we're probably just getting a lot more stone it's okay what about these can i break them for clay damn it oh these are like primitive plus building pieces that's cool also it's super dark right now let's see <laughs> let me pop on my torch Oh, man. Yeah, it, it gets extremely dark on this map. Like, way darker than any other map, I think. I, I don't know. There's just, like, something about it. So, I'm on Gamma 4 right now, and it's still really, really dark. I've been noticing people have been commenting about it. And obviously, yeah, I want to try and help you guys be able to see things. But, like, do I go up to Gamma 6 now? <laughs> like, I have no idea. So, yeah, maybe I'll uh, I'll do some tinkering with, uh, with some footage or something if it gets super, super dark and you guys can't see. That is a stegop ahead swinging, I think. Or is it a... What is that? I can't even see, dude. 
I think it's a stego. All right, so I think I need to head a little bit further in this direction over here. Unfortunately, I'm doing all of this at nighttime, so that doesn't really help out a huge amount. Oh, there's microraptors here. I just saw them. Get away from me, dude. Like, leave me alone. What's wrong with you, you turd? Where? There you are. Let me just kill them this way. It's much easier. Uh, in fact, give me a hand here, bro. Uh, I forgot. I don't have my whistle on my mouse anymore. I used to have that, and it was great. I have less buttons on my mouse nowadays, so yeah, I just keep trying to hit the button to do it, but obviously it's not there. Uh, let's just pop you in a passive because I don't want you running off super, super far. Come on, bro. Die already. Oh my god, you're so annoying. I could just shoot it, to be honest, but yeah, there we go. <laughs> it's all good. Um, oh my god, go away. Ah, screw you. Okay, here we go. Boom. Dead. Passive, come here. Oh yeah, you already were on passive. You're just following me. That's okay. All right, we're good. Um, <laughs> uh, dude, let's see. Let's pop that there. We gotta actually be able to see things. So if I work a little bit further up this hill here, we should be getting kind of closer to where we need to be. Uh, yeah, I should also actually mark this spot on my map as well. Like I need to be marking every single treasure chest on my map, and um, and then that way I can just do like a loop around the map eventually, and, and find like a good way to get around to all of them, check them all out, and, and hopefully get some really good loot. Either that, or I could put down a teleporter beside them. I don't know. Like, we'll, we'll see. We'll see what we get to. Um, where at bats am I? Oh, I'm at the giant, uh, yeah, yeah, this spot here. Okay, cool. I know exactly where I am right now. In fact, actually, I did get some comments about, um, if you guys remember that cave that we checked out. I th the hell was that? We checked out a cave, I think, in, like, uh, episode two or something like that. Um, I don't know exactly what episode it was in, but it was over there by, like, that cliff area. People were, have been commenting saying that there's treasure can actually spawn inside of there as well. Not only just at like that little bit with the, um, I guess like the little bridge kind of going across. It's like underneath the waterfall. Um, the spot that we've been going to, obviously we know they can spawn there, but they apparently can also spawn inside of that cave. So I actually want to check that one out as well. So let's do this one and then we'll pop around and get that one as well. And uh, then we should be good to go. I probably should have checked out that thing back there for some um, sleeping bags, but it's all good. Let's see. Oh, I gotta tame one of these guys. They're really cool looking. Holy crap. It's like a freaking tiger. It's amazing. Uh, 102. I think I actually saw him in the last episode. All right. There's the water. So that means the river should be up ahead here. I'm gonna keep my eyes peeled for another horse as well, actually. Because, I mean, like, I definitely could use another one. Because an imprinted horse is gonna be a lot better than a non-imprinted horse. So if we can manage to do that soon, that would be great. Let's see. Um, yeah, yeah, yeah. We're, I can actually see the drop from here. Dude. How the hell did I miss that? I guess it was daytime when I was going through here. I don't know. You guys got like eagle eyes or something. It's crazy. I mean, I guess for the most part, people were saying that they could hear it. So yeah, there it is though. Uh, yeah, I can hear it now as well. But obviously in the moment, I wasn't really listening out for something like that. Uh, are you kidding me? <gasps> no, 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 no. Oh, crap, 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 crap. Let me get him. Come on. Yeah. Let me get this dude. Am I going to be okay? I'm probably not going to be able to fight this. Okay, we got to we gotta run. Oh, man. Did not expect that to happen. All right. Is he chasing me? Dude, what the hell? Holy crap. Also, apparently now you can Bola um, Denonicus. You couldn't always do that. <laughs> He's coming. I'm not even going to try it. Oh, my. Seriously, bro. Come on. Really? That is, oh, that is so frustrating. Oh, the Microraptors. What is wrong with you? Oh, rip horse. <laughs> no. Now the name I pick is for a grave. <laughs> God damn it. Microraptors. Like, seriously, bro. Like, what is wrong with those things? They're so annoying. I just can't with them. <laughs> That's so unfair. <laughs> oh. Oh my god. I was fine. I was completely fine. Running from insects and a Denonicus, sure, but at the same time, like, come on. That is the worst possible luck. Oh man, this this little mission right here. I knew I shouldn't have listened to you guys. Stupid treasure. <laughs> I just I just got this like treasure brain right now. I need all of it, so yeah, unfortunately now we're stuck in a situation where I need to go get my stuff, and there's a Denonicus beside it, so that's great. Also, Microraptors, but it won't affect me on foot. None of that's useful. Um, okay, great. Uh, God damn it. That really sucks. I mean, like, there's nothing I could have done there. How the hell would I have known that there was a Microraptor chasing me, too? Also, just in general, 
that wouldn't have done anything. So yeah, like <laughs> just I just got arced. There was no possible way of avoiding what just happened. It is what it is. We just need to move on, pick up our items, and uh, and tame something different. Rip horse though. That was a freaking 180 and everything. That's very disappointing that I lost it. Ah uh, man. I mean, I think I was I was playing it smart. I mean, I could have just picked him up and then grappled, but like at the same time, like I didn't see my crafters, so I don't know. I guess I shouldn't be trying to like you know rationalize all of it in, in my mind again we just we got arced that's just the way it is all right well anyway at least this this treasure's still here hopefully we can manage to actually grab it it's also a blue drop as well which is better than green so hopefully there's some good stuff in here i, I don't know we're gonna see hopefully um <laughs> there's my there's my body i wonder is jimmy even still online yeah he is okay so he saw my embarrassment that's not fair <laughs> okay let's do it can i grab this drop first maybe what do we got Ooh, okay some chitin armor apparently you can pick up the gems from these spots as well um i guess not here though but yeah i've been getting comments telling me that okay there he is um well we got some chitin armor <laughs> and i got an iguanodon saddle i think right yeah um maybe i'll just tame a quick iguanodon and then and then we'll we'll be good by the way those little rivers being able to swim in that just throws me off so much let me pick that up is the, does the horse have a bag here i don't think so i don't believe it had a bag i don't believe it had anything on it oh you turd okay hang on i gotta see can you bowl of these things now because you you didn't be able you, you didn't used to be able to do that and bump you can do it why is why did i think that you couldn't because like i was certain that you couldn't that's weird all right well anyway are you kidding me no do you see that? Do you see that right beside him? Where did that thing come from? Why does it look like Red Skull? Look at it. What the hell? <laughs> He's like, oh my god, he looks like that freaking demon from um, what? Are you, what's that movie? Uh, The Conjuring, or is it the other one? Insidious, right? Yeah, he, he looks like looks like the demon from Insidious or something, like freaking Darth Maul or something. I don't even know. That is so terrifying, though. All right, well, cool. Um, I don't know, if, like that that loot wasn't really worth it, so I'm not super happy right now. Uh, also, I lost a horse, so that's that's cool. Um, all right, let me let me get all the way over here. Hopefully, that other treasure chest is gonna be here, and I can actually manage to salvage something out of this disaster of an adventure here. Ah, I really wish I had seen that in the last episode. I wouldn't come back over here. Yeah, not a great idea. Um, I do still have the Pachyrannosaurus, though. Um, but yeah, you know, obviously not uh, not the best. And, oh, no, I lost my hat as well. It's broken. I gotta go back and fix it. Ah, crap. Everything's gone wrong here today. It's fine. All right, let me, uh, let me see. We're actually fairly far. Oh, what's that? Is that like a big-ass cave or something? Hmm, kind of want to go check it out. Should we? feel like we should uh do i have any hide i do not okay i think what i need to do is i need to at least get oh you know what let me actually go down here where's that oh is that a horse is that a horse please <gasps> no damn it it's a tiger <laughs> i just i saw something like just plain kind of colors and i'm like oh horse you know uh but that's cool <laughs> it's a tiger instead maybe i need to get me one of those because like those have killed jim a couple times here today so clearly they're um you know they they can kill Jim. I guess that doesn't really take much, but you know, um, <laughs> could be a good idea. One fourteen, not great. Um, all right, horse. The horse dream is dead for today. We're we're not trying to go and get one. Also, I don't even have carrots with me, do I? No, I do not. Okay, cool. Anyway, let's um, let's just go on a massive treasure hunt instead. I, I mean, I can manage to do this. I'm I'm like agile and nimble enough on my feet here to be able to get away from most kind of encounters using the uh. The crossbow i'm saying most because not all of them uh crap that stuff didn't de or respawn i thought it might actually do that considering the fact that uh we moved super super far away is there something dead here or maybe something that i could kill hmm because i know that we we don't have any hide up in that little shack up there i don't see anything unfortunately all right cool let's um let's get up here let's grab that treasure maybe i'll check out that other spot as well and let's see let me just grapple a little bit this hill is very very steep look at that <laughs> It's a very very steep hill your knees would burn so much getting up this hill man that is crazy all right here we go we're kind of close to the other spot um i don't know maybe i can manage to find something here i haven't actually seen any Denonica's nests so far so if i can find one of those actually that would be a great salvage for today i mean like i would trade a horse for a Denonicus. Denonicus are great they do spawn down here i don't actually see any uh 
nest though yeah okay cool let's um let's see how do i want to do this probably just like parachute right through the middle here and then maybe try and just hook myself up onto that bridge and then i can hopefully manage to do this i'm not going to go into that potential cave without you know proper precautions so i at least want a um a sleeping bag before doing that but this cave over here is safe i mean we've been in there before there wasn't any creatures at all uh let's see let me grapple right there dude these reusable grapple hooks are just coming in clutch for this series <laughs> so great all right let's get over there and let me i need to like jump out this way i forgot that you could do that to be honest um if you just like point and, and jump you can jump out in like a different direction instead of just like jumping against the cliff like that it's kind of handier if you need to go up like a steep slope let's see chest uh no can we pick up things from here we also cannot do that okay cool it's good to at least test these things because you know supposedly you're gonna you're gonna be able to do that in some spots but i don't know let's uh let's get over here also at some point i think that we need to actually check out this massive flowing river i kind of want to like sail up or down it i don't probably down the river would make more sense but yeah i don't know we, we totally need to do that at some point because like it just gives me like pure ragnarok vibes if you guys remember super early on in the ragnarok series from like way oh there is a chest right there nice from like way back there um yeah we um we sailed up like the massive canyon river and it was a really great adventure let's see nothing to pick up here all right cool but we do have a blue chest whoa whoa hang on a second here let me get back over oh what the hell is this what on earth what is that <laughs> is that like it oh it's under the map okay there's just like a hole cool um all right great holy crap look at this galley saddle J again by the way i don't boost loot on here it's just like this that is an amazing shotgun we need to make some shotgun shells also uh you know <laughs> that's pretty amazing too damn all right uh worth the horse I, I think so i think so i wouldn't have come over here for if i didn't potentially think that i could get some good loot and uh yeah we we definitely that kind of aspect of the adventure here today has has paid off we just i think at this point i just need to find something good that i can tame and then this is like the perfect episode <laughs> you know just like losing a creature but gaining something better um could be good We're, there's a heat wave right now actually so that's probably not the most amazing thing oh we can get across right here cool um all right cool so yeah that's oh you know what? i didn't even mark those two spots i know where they are once i have a gps i'll do it um in fact the one that i actually did mark i marked that in single player so you know i wanted to get the exact coordinates but uh it's, it's all good we'll uh we'll do that at some other stage let's see dude what the hell this map is like freaking blood red it's like we're having a blood moon during the day with this heat wave it's crazy I actually really like this effect it reminds me a lot of the island because you don't often see this effect on the other maps i mean maybe you do a little bit but not a huge amount definitely on the island though like you see this all the time it's great but um yeah let's uh let's get up here let's try and parachute all the way back to our base <laughs> and uh and then hopefully we can manage to actually salvage some part of this episode we grappled i think from over here right when we were with jim i think it was like right around here we grappled to like there ish oh no didn't do it hey there we go you know what i really need to get actually a uh, a little hyenodon pack <laughs> that totally needs to happen because obviously you know i have all those meat packs and oh what the hell that is cool hang on a second but yeah if we could manage to find some hyenodons i would totally tame them i haven't actually seen any so far i don't think um definitely feel like i'd find some over here but i don't know if i want to try and make this little adventure um into this biome without an actual tame to ride on we got like a big like kind of courtyard area here which is cool um floating x cool probably something that's not loaded in there bunch of like towers and everything as well i'm just trying to see if there's like any like uh i don't know i don't really know what i'm looking for i mean it's just like a cool runes all right let's see let's uh let's head back over towards our base there it is over there and run and parachute and emote <laughs> oh this is stupid looking do we have any good creatures in this area that i could potentially get because i need to stop losing my tames that's one thing but uh yeah i should also try and get some like better stuff is that a horse oh, it's a level 18 add a zero to that please <laughs> all right we're also super high up this time damn i uh i definitely jumped from a little bit higher than before but i guess we're also going in the right direction so things are working out quite well we've already checked you out 
A stego. Ooh, I was about to say a stego could be cool, but there's a freaking 180 stego. It's also super bloody though, so I doubt I'll be able to get it without actually um killing it potentially. I don't know, man. That's uh yeah, maybe the tame dream here today is not going to come true, but I don't know. <laughs> it could be great. I have no idea if we're going to be able to find anything so good like right beside the base here. Um maybe we could tame one of these little bird things. The little uh, Corvus, right? How the hell do I even tame you? What level are you? Why are you coming for me? Dude, I didn't do anything to you. Okay, hang on. It's only level 18. I guess, you know, I could probably still tame it. Let's see. You can bolo them, right? I think I boloed one before. Pretty sure that I did. Boom. Got him. <laughs> uh, can't even see him. He's in there somewhere. I see his name tag. Let's see. I might be able to try and knock him out. Um, let's give it a go. Uh, he's like right there. Shouldn't take too many arrows if you can knock them out. Boom. And maybe another? Hey, there we go. Okay, what do they eat? Probably just meat, right? Uh, hold to remove Bola. Let's do that. Then I should be able to feed him. Or maybe not. Wait, what? Okay, let me just move all of these plants here. <laughs> I guess you tame them a different way, clearly. Because he's not... He doesn't seem to have an inventory. Oh my god, what is with all these plants? Dude, like, let me... I want to just see the bird. Oh my god, I still can't even really see him. Okay, yeah, yeah. he's like right there. Can't access him, so clearly, yeah, this is this is not how you do it. I don't I don't know how to do it. We'll figure it out though. Um, let's get the kill on the Pachyrannosaurus. wherever he is. Boom, he's dead. So yeah, there's probably like a different way of doing that. Um, I I don't actually know what it would be because it's a new creature to me. So cool. All right, let's uh, that's a trend on in my face. I was about to say, is that a raptor? Oh dude, okay, can't really handle more of that here today. Um, all right, well, great. Anyway, um, well, we made it back to base. <laughs> We're, we are up some loot, but down a horse, which is, you know, maybe it's good, maybe it's bad. Uh, I don't really know. <laughs> so, it does kind of suck that we lost it, but at the end of the day, you know, um, I guess it was kind of inevitable doing all that adventuring on foot into Denonicus lands. Let's see. Let me actually pop on all of this stuff because I'm getting really, really hot in the chitin armor. Um... All right, let's see. Let me, I guess I could like pop that into here just so Jim knows that we have it. Don't think he'll really care about some of this other stuff though. Pop a bunch of that into there. In fact, actually an Iguanodon would be a really great team right now, actually. Yeah, an Iguanodon would be great. If I could find one, I'll totally tame it, but I don't think I've seen one so far. Let's grab that fixed up and um, what else? Oh, we got this. I didn't even notice that. Huh, I guess I can make one. I could probably make one for Jim as well. You know what? I'm gonna do that. He deserves it. <laughs> Let's see. Can we? What else do we need for this? Yeah, just the cooked prime meat. I don't actually think that we have any prime meat though. We do. We have a bunch. Okay, Jim's been busy. Let's see. Do we even have a campfire? No, we do not. <laughs> okay. Oh, you know what? I need to make the shotgun shells. That's what I need to be doing. Let's see. Um. Oh yeah. This goes into there. Boom. Let's see. Can we make any shotgun shells? I made a bunch of uh gunpowder earlier i might be able to do it i'm gonna totally need a little bit more metal though yeah i think i'll just leave all of that into there let's uh let's go ahead and make up two of these so boom do this first and then two of those i'll give jim the better one okay that one's pretty good Ooh, both of them are actually pretty good this one's got 31 percent. okay very very nice let me go ahead and just chuck this one on the floor could just save it to grind it but i don't have a grinder so it's okay uh, let's see. I'm gonna just pop it into a box here. Yeah, he's got his little box right here. Boom. So he gets that one. I'll, I'll keep this one. Okay, so we got like 42 rounds on it. That's good enough. Um, I mean, there's a Tyranodon right there. I can't not do this. <laughs> it's, it's so perfect. Boom. Now, bear in mind, that is a flyer. So we're not gonna do that much damage to, uh, normal, like, ground creatures. But if I can go find something that I could potentially use this on, that would be great. In fact, let me go ahead and just chop you up. Thank you. <laughs> All right, let's see. What do we have around here? Not the Bronto. Never the Bronto. Um, it's something different. Something that's not a Pteranodon and that's not a Bronto. And I see my target. A uh, chubby little weird elephant pig. And boom. <laughs> oh, okay. 116 is pretty good, man. That's pretty good. So we're doing like... How many times that hit? Like five times maybe-ish? So we're doing like 500 and something damage. Um, pretty amazing, actually. So could definitely come in handy in like a clutch situation where there's like something running at me or eating my tames, you know, because that keeps happening. So, you know, could be could be really, really handy in those in those kinds of situations. Um, oh, one of those power swords would be great. Maybe we need to tame one of those in the next episode. 
That is a beautiful looking power sword though. I love those colors. Damn. All right, let's see. Anything else good out here? Doesn't really look like it. Okay. Well, anyway, guys, I think that's going to be the end of this video. If you did enjoy it, go ahead, do me a favor, hit the like button. Um, obviously, you know, we made some progress, but we also lost some progress. So, you know, it's a give and take of arc. It, realistically, I'm probably going to look back on that footage and just laugh about the fact that I just got arced so hard. But it is what it is. Uh, Microraptors can go suck it, though, because <laughs> those things are just freaking demons, dude. Uh, I think I need... As soon as you have a Microraptor, right? They don't attack you. They, they can't stun you if you have one, right? I'm pretty sure that's how it works. So maybe that's what I need to do. I just need to go out and get myself one. And uh, hopefully that will stop my, you know, constant uh, stunning. <laughs> like my constant, like, target on my back to stun me. That would be amazing. Um, I just want to check this out just in case it's harvestable. Nope, doesn't seem to be. All right, cool. Well, yeah, I'll catch you guys in the next one.